Well, we tried to stop by and see Phil Blurton from No Limit Racing, but unfortunately, he was a little bit too prepared. Uh, his desert race car was already in the trailer, headed down to King of the Hammers, and they were just putting the tires and wheels on his uh, rock crawling race car. Both of them can ams. He has two cars, and he's racing two separate classes. So when we get down to the lake bed, we are going to sit down and talk to him, but uh, unfortunately, he was too prepared, and he's already on the way. So here's a little bit of footage that we got just walking around the shop as they were final loading. Uh, can't wait to see him down on the lake bed, and uh, hope he does well in both races. You only keep the first place in your office. Yeah, I used to keep all the second place in the other office, and then the other day I had Chris box them all up and put them in storage because I just didn't want to look at them. So, <laughs> so these are all first place trophies. Yeah, yeah. I like you're gonna need a bigger office. Get some more trophies. about King of the Hammers this year? Do you think your dad's going to win or you think he's going to do well? I think he's going to do well. You think so? I like that. Has he been uh, getting the car ready and just working a lot? Yeah. Yeah? Tell him what you did on it today. Yeah, what'd you do on the car today? I got, I got to uh, put stickers on it. Oh, I heard that. You helped your dad wrap the car, huh? Do you, do you have any bubbles on your stickers? No bubbles, no wrinkles. Ooh, I like it. about 100 grand to race the Baja 1000 and you get the bull plaque from the 80s. I feel like that I can make that myself. This one's same year we got the championship trophy, so that's pretty cool. That's the score championship. Yeah, that one's overall championship. Overall for the whole for the whole year. Out of all classes, you get the most points, you get that one.